Okay guys, I'm playing a little bit of RuneScape right now. I just want to say hello to everyone now there that has watched the videos and actually acknowledged them. Got a few comments. Feeling kind of good about it. Um, this video is mainly going to be showing my family on what I do when I'm in the members world and I like to mine. So, this is a little different, but it's still going to be the same content uploaded on my YouTube channel. I do make sure I do a lot of in-depth you know, experiences without the levels to make it so it's very understanding and, you know, good to watch. So, let's just get right into it. I'm going to be showing you the Members World family. So, right now we're in a place called Motherload Mines. And what I like to call it is Easy Street, because you could pretty much just mine and not really, um worry about clicking as much you will move in a few areas but as you progress and try and get your rewards I don't even have one reward yet I'm on 19 gold nuggets believe it or not I'm trying to afford the jacket so pretty much in this situa situation in this scenario um, I want to be going ahead and showing you guys on what I do my family that watches this video not people that already know how to play the game or anyone out here that knows nothing about what I'm doing. So pretty much what I'm doing right now is I'm in a cave. And I am mining little areas throughout the cave called the veins. They're called ore veins. And uh, what you get from them is a thing called pay dirt. And so when you get the pay dirt, you need to run into a siphon through this little water area over here. And this little, this little uh, nook, as you could say. This area with the flowing stream, you put everything in there, you put it in the hopper, and then you pretty much just go right to the sack, and uh, you pretty much just collect what is in the sack. Now it could be a variant of different things. See, I just got coal and gold ores, which is pretty cool. I usually try and wait till I fill up my inventory, but I don't know if that matters. I'm kind of still new at it, so I guess it depends um, what you feel like doing. And then you got a little area up here, which I haven't accessed yet because I'm not a level 72 mining. Nor do I have 100 nuggets to spend to get up there in the first place. So that might be taking a, a, a huge chunk out of my day-to-day -day life to try and get up there which I really don't care about man because I'm down here and there's hardly anyone taking my uh taking my uh fun away you know what I mean like I'm right there next to the deposit so it really don't matter much to me I just want to get as many pay dirts as I can and pretty much just rank up my mining level up here as you can see I'm a level um I'm a level 48 mining so I'll be 49 shortly after or before I end the video. So, um, where you gotta go to find this place is pretty much in Fa Falador, or Faldor, whatever, how to, <laughs> however you pronounce it. And so what you'll be doing is you'll be introduced to a little area down here. Let me just get out of this. I, I forgot how to get out of the cave. Is that, are you kidding me? Oh no, I know how to get out now. So, um, you want to mine these rocks when you're in the member world. If you know nothing about mining, or if you don't know nothing about the game, this is my first time guide pretty much showing you guys on what I do to actually... I, I just found out about it. I literally just found out about it, and I think it's a good idea to let everyone know. Um, you don't want to be mining these ores down here. That's like going to do you no good. Unless you really want to do something like that. So you're in this little cat... That's going to have to be turned down a bit. People are trying to sleep here. So, right next to the party room where they usually have drop part. Is this the drop party area? I forgot. I guess it is, yeah. So, right where they have the parties or whatever, where people come and just gather around and get try and get loot. You're going to be introduced to a little staircase over here. Yeah, let me walk outside the door so you guys can see. So, in... In blue, what you want to do is you want to go to the party room, and then you want to take these stairs to go down, and you'll be introduced to the cave. You'll see some scorpions. These bad guys don't attack you, I promise, unless you want to mess around with them. I don't know why you would want to do that. 
And so you go right into the cave. It looks a little overwhelming. It looks like there's monsters down here, but don't please don't worry. If you're a low level and you want to get your mining up, be my guest. You're gonna have to clear some rocks out of the way, some like rock fall, little landslide area over here. And uh, every once in a while, these things break. So if you want to get your smithing level up, you can fix the strut in the water wheel. And uh, yeah. Sometimes they break down and other people repair them and you don't got to worry about it too much because there's a lot of people here. As you can see up there. <laughs> Hold on. I know no one's not up there. So, yeah, all these people are just doing the, um, doing the smart thing. I haven't got there yet, so. And that pretty much goes in detail and depth into what I was trying to explain in this video. I hope you guys enjoy your night. And I hope everyone has a wonderful, wonderful Super Bowl. And, uh... Please, be my guest. Subscribe to my channel. I don't know. Anything anything would help. I'm not trying to get paid. I'm just spreading the word. For people that like you and me that need a little bit of a guidance. I see there's new people down here all the time. So Let me just check this guy's level. See what level he is. His name's City Morgue. He is a level. He's not letting me check. Oh, well. That's great. Alright, bye.